Hi, I'm Adam McDowell with parkbench.com slash North Center. I'm here today with Tom Romberg from Windy City Ninjas. Hi, Tom, how are you doing today? I'm doing great, thanks, Adam. Great, so Windy City Ninjas born out of sort of uh, uh, your son's love for the American Ninja Warrior show. Um, tell us a little bit about what services you offer um, from camps to open gym and, and everything else. Yeah, so pre-COVID, right, we were offering everything from classes to day off camps, summer camps, birthday parties are obviously a big thing on the weekends, um, open gyms, and then family fun night, um, uh, one Friday a month. Then we're doing a lot of special fundraising events with schools. Mm -hmm. Now, in the world we are now, post-COVID, or not post-COVID, during COVID, um, we've had to make some adjustments, right? So right now our primary offerings um, are summer camps and classes. And with camps, we're doing groups of 10, um, three groups of 10 or less that are separated and isolated to their group only throughout camp, even take you know, their breaks and think areas separate from the other group. Um, everyone's wearing masks, kids and employees. We get temperature checks um, when they check in. And then um, <clears throat> uh, we're making sure, obviously, we're doing social distancing. And then we're doing extensive cleaning um, every day and then intermittent cleaning um, of all the high touch services between any of our services. Um, and the kids all have to hand wash and sanitize um, when, whenever they re-enter the gym. So camps to run 9 to 3.30 and then we're doing classes on the weekdays at 4 and 5 p.m. And then on Saturdays at 9, 10, 11, and 12. And we just started um, opening up uh, for private events or parties of smaller groups on Saturdays at both locations. And we're, we're there, we're looking for people that have their cohort group or their pods, you know, smaller groups they're comfortable with. Everyone's still wearing masks um, and following all the social distancing and cleaning and safety practices. Uh, but just to provide an outlet for, you know, adults and kids that just haven't been able to do as much fun physical activity in a safe yeah. environment with their group. Yeah. yeah. In case anybody hasn't seen the, the TV show, these are sort of giant obstacle courses, right? Yeah. So we got, we kind of catered all ages. Like a good example is, you know, our warped walls, which is the curved wall, you know, everyone I think is familiar with an American Ninja Warrior. We have, you know, a six and a half foot wall for the youngest kids, you know, three to five. Uh, we have an eight foot wall a 10 foot wall and then a 12 and 14 and a half foot wall and then you know it's our gyms generally in the front area tends to be more geared toward the smaller kids you know with a lot of floor based and added obstacles and that you can differentiate um and and a lot of these obstacles are based on progressions too so um you know that four can do some of the more basic progressions where a kid with eight can do some of the more advanced so well, that's what we always try to do in Ninjas, have a lot of progressions there for our programming for the kids to continue to be pushed. Great. And so if people want to learn more information, uh, where can they find you, websites and social media and things like that? They can go to our website, windycityninjas.com. And there, you know, we're active on Facebook and Instagram. You can click right there on our Facebook or Instagram icons. Um, we have uh, pages uh, both for Elmhurst and for Chicago locations. Um, and yeah, I mean, there's, there's plenty of info on there, but, uh, you know, classes are, are something that we're going to be really um, pushing and doing a lot with the kids in this environment. We can do that in a safe manner and socially distant when school starts back. And then we're also going to be releasing some programming for remote learning, um, day camp, you know, partial day camp for kids to get activity during this, this kind of different climate we're all in. Um, and so look for information soon to be released there. Yeah, so that's not in partnership, but it, but based on what the CPS schedule looks like, it's going to be for all the at-home learning. You're working around and with that, right? Yeah, so we're going to do, there's, I kind of think of it as three offerings. As one is um, e-learning assistance, where we're creating a safe facility with Wi-Fi for the kids, um, assistance where, where needed with, you know, homework, not tutoring, but assistance where needed more facilitation in a safe environment. Uh, the second is provide some type of class or day off camp, um, not day off day camp, when the kids have a break in their learning schedule, um, to get physical activity and social engagement with other kids in a safe manner. And the third would be a, a hybrid where we actually provide both of those 
um, as a service offering. So we're awaiting some details on the schedule and parent feedback before we put out our formal offerings there. Great. Well, Tom, thank you for all your time today and uh, talking about Windy City Ninjas. And thank you all for watching. I'm Adam McDowell with Berkshire Hathaway Home Services Chicago, your path to home, and parkbench.com slash north center.